Hey guys, it's Ashwindy again, and this is the video I've been talking about with, in my opinion, the worst gun, or one of the worst guns on the game, and opinions aren't facts, so uh, someone else may hate the Uzi Maw or the Dragon of Maw, but this is one of the worst guns, I think, and as you can see, it's the Olympia, uh, it looks pretty sick in gold. And as the title suggests, I go flawless with it, so I was very, very proud of this gameplay. I haven't seen many uh, flawless videos with the Olympia out there, and I end up going and getting a pretty decent score with it, which uh, made me very happy at the time. I was absolutely buzzing after this gameplay. And the reason I think this gun is one of the worst guns is mainly for the fact that you only get two bullets. And you do need sleight of hand on this class. And like, I'm just going to speak about the game here. And there's four people there. Let's say I was using the spaz. I would have been able to spray eight bullets. And probably killed all of them. But instead I only got two kills and an assist. Because I had to reload again. So yeah, that's why I think this is one of the worst guns. It's not bad for uh, the range. I think you are better off shooting them over a little bit of a distance than close range. You get tend to get hit markers from close range, uh, whereas if they're far away, a bit further away, obviously not miles away, otherwise you won't hit them at all. Uh, get a few kills with it, and see that's that's quite a distance there where I just got a kill with that. So anyway, I've got the usual kill streaks on. I've gone for Scavenger Pro uh, with this, and I've seen a video on YouTube of someone suggesting that with most shotgun classes you should use ghost but everyone can use what they want really uh, you just tend to find a class that's more suitable for you and that's why some people have different favorite guns they do better with those guns and that's why it's their favorite uh, the spaz isn't classed as my favorite yet even though I've got now over eight and a half thousand kills with it uh, the accuracy is good my, it's the highest gun for KD that I've got as well so fingers crossed it will do soon. I have been playing some ground war and stuff and I will be uploading some gameplays that are a bit different from 6v6 team deathmatch. But I'm thinking of posting this video on Machinima on the respawn army thing on Facebook and I'd really appreciate if you guys could maybe bump it up on there as well because uh, like I said earlier I haven't seen many of these up on YouTube uh, going for us with the Olympia and obviously kill streaks. I mean, I've seen people pick it up and use it, but not use it from the start and get a decent gameplay. So, I'd really appreciate if you could bump it up on there and try and get a few more views for me. And also, if you could give it a big like as well if you do like this video. If you don't like this video, then I'm sorry, I can't please everyone. Um, but please don't give it a dislike. I, d I don't understand people who dislike videos. If I watch a video and I don't like it, then I'm not going to click the dislike button. I'll just leave it and I just won't watch it again. Rather than giving it a dislike, I think that's a bit harsh on the people who've made it and obviously taken the time out. But I've now got over 450 subs, which is unbelievable. Uh, I'm absolutely buzzing about that. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for watching all my videos. And the comments you leave are truly amazing and it does make my day. It makes me so happy. And... Yeah, I really can't thank you enough. I'm um, getting plenty of views per vid. So thanks for watching and thanks for requesting different guns for me to use. This request came from Pacacula ages ago. So thanks for that. And it's just came to an end. So it went 30 to 0 with the Gold Olympia. So if you like it, guys, please give it a thumbs up. Please bump it on Machinima. If you haven't already, please subscribe and please comment. Thanks for watching and I will see you all later. Thanks again, guys.